Hi guys, I'm Tara. I'm... Let me give you a little bit of a background of Works in Progress. Actually, we're a not-for-profit. The money that we do get goes back into the community via of a uh, class that we teach. And you can sign up for that. It's Saturdays, not every Saturday. I think we're doing it about once every three weeks now. Um, so we have all ranges. You can come in um, as a beginner. We're working on getting a little bit more uh, advanced classes in the works, but we uh, can teach you how to do this. But let me run through a little bit of that um, right now. But let me show you a little bit of what we do here. Typically, a client will come and uh, they'll have an idea of what they want, what they want it on, and they'll have their branding. Uh, we do offer art services, but uh, this one, for example, they had their branding package all ready to go. So here we have, um, this is a tequila company that's just getting started, um, and they wanted this image on some totes. So just to walk you through the process, um, it starts off with you know either a vector or um, some sort of um, JPEG, PSD, whatever the case, we take that and then we turn it into a film. So that gets printed here. And then at the end, I'll walk you through a few more processes, but you end up with something like this. So let's show you how that gets made. So just as an example, um, oh, well, here we have, these shirts are Yave. This was what I was showing you a little bit of before. Got a one color on the front. So that takes one screen, and then on the back you've got a two color, which that'll take two screens. These are all screens that we've shot. Um, just as an example, little shout out to New York co-ed soccer. What I was showing you before is that black image on the film is where the light's not gonna touch this blue emulsion, so it won't cure, and you can rinse that off. And now, when you pull the plastisol, which is our ink, you can peek over there, um, that'll go through that spot on the screen and that's how you create a screen printed image. So as an example, this is the one um, that you saw the film for and this is the screen that came out of it. You know, we were doing totes with this so they just line it up. So on um, multiple color jobs, like that shirt that you saw, the Yave that had the key underneath, that'll take two screens and basically they'll line it up so that um, this gold piece will line up with the next screen and that's how you get your, your two colors. Anything that gets printed that's plastisol obviously is going to need to go through this um, heater and that just cures the ink. So at the end. Here again, you have your one color, and on the back, you have the two color. So that'll be one screen for the black and one screen for the gold. So back here is uh, where we actually do the class. I mean, we, we'll teach the basics and the theory out uh, in the main room, and then back here we'll, with the students, we'll actually print. So um, every student gets one shirt or tote as they prefer with the class price, but then also, we have all of these stock shirts and some dead stock that we um, then can sell at cost if they want to keep printing and have shirts to give to their friends and family. So uh, Works in Progress actually started as uh, Design East in 1983. John Milstein and Emily Clark, um, he was a painter and she's a sculptor and they had this shop where they would also sell um, screen printed goods. In 96, they started taking on interns um, and then we became a not-for-profit. Now we're here on, on 4th Street, um, and we're a proud member of FAB, FAB NYC, so that's 4th Arts Block, and 4th Arts Block is um, the city's premier naturally occurring cultural district, um, and what that is, I think that founded in 2001. Essentially, it's all of these not-for-profits and non-profits um, that got together to save, well, their homes, but like also, the cultural diversity and, and arts programs in, in the area. Um, so we're heavily community based. We have, like I said, we have the internship program, we have classes, we do lots of events locally too where, um, I mean pre-COVID, uh, we would participate in like festivals and give away t-shirts to passerbys. Um, we'll do events here also. Um, and that pretty much wraps it up. So if you're looking for screen printed 
t-shirts, totes, whatever it may be. Um, if you're looking to learn a little bit and do some hands-on printing and want to take one of the classes, uh, if you want to have an event or anything of the sort, uh, get on our website or check us out on Instagram. It's works in progress.